Hey guys, welcome back. I am finally almost done with my semester at college and that's why I haven't been able to get as many videos out to you as possible. So I do apologize for that, but I'm back right now and I have been wanting to do a review on this particular product since I've been using it for a very, very long time. So I might as well get it up and get it out of the way here. So I'm gonna be reviewing this stuff here. You've probably seen it before and you've probably seen it when they were first toting about the whole micellar water business but this is the simple micellar cleansing water the only places i know where i found it at was over at ulta beauty i think a select target store and walgreens now if you did find it at other places please let me know in the comments below because that would be a blessing been a bit of trouble with the internet so the only price that I know which was over at Ulta Beauty which is where I purchased this from by the way it was around $7.99 plus tax so that's pretty much around $8 and I don't remember the price of what it was at the Walgreens over there it might be somewhat less if you have like a Walgreens rewards thing or if you have an Ulta um, Beauty rewards thing if you have points on there then you can easily use those to decrease the price but I got mine from Ulta Beauty here and as you can see, I'm pretty much down to here. I'm almost done with it, and I'm gonna be purchasing another bottle. It looks like this. This is the back of it. It does have some sort of um, some sort of flower extract. I do not. Matricaria. Matricaria flower extract, something around that. It's pretty much designed for sensitive skin, but people of all skin types can use it. Unfortunately, I am not going to be. Well, I'll talk about that later on but simply put this is a really good micellar water I like it and this was my very first micellar water that I've tried and for a minute there I thought that was a car but anyway first micellar water that I have tried and I got to tell you I really really like it and considering that I've heard so many positive reviews about this particular product it doesn't surprise me that it's a really good product especially considering that I have oily skin However, I highly recommend that when you use this, use these kinds of um, pads. Use these little basic cotton pads. You can find these over at Target or you can find these at your general dollar store for like a buck. I ended up getting these from Target and I actually got two of them at a time. And for me, considering that I don't wear a lot of makeup, in fact the only amount of makeup, if you qualify it as makeup, I wear a tinted moisturizer on top of a primer that mattifies my face and that's about it on rare occasions on many occasions I don't even wear that I just bare my face out so for me when my face is completely bare maybe to the extent that I just put on a primer so my face can be mattified since I have oily skin I see that it only takes about maybe two to three cotton pads to just clean my whole face it does really well. It almost feels like you're wiping a toner or just wiping some distilled water on your face. Mostly, to me, it feels like wiping a toner on my face. You don't need to vigorously rub so hard here, and I find that it doesn't irritate my eyes either. So that is an absolute plus. It takes like maybe, if I have my bare face, it takes maybe two to three of these to take care of my face. On rare occasions, it only takes about two. Now for this, right now I'm currently wearing a tinted moisturizer, so in this case it would take about three to four, rare occasions three, three of these little pads here to get rid of all of this, and that's only because I wear a light layer of tinted moisturizer. Now for the ladies over here that wear like several layers of makeup on their face, be enough. You might have to add an extra step to your cleansing routine and not just use this, unless you want to go through several cotton pads at a time which I really don't recommend. It doesn't irritate my face whatsoever and it does dry to this nice smooth finish that leaves my face very moisturized. However, if you do, there is a chance that you can overuse this. If you have never used micellar water for the first time, there is a chance that you can overuse it, which I have done in the past. And if you do, you might find that your face turns out very greasy and oily. To combat this, what I've done personally is if I find myself overusing this, which again I'm still guilty of, I usually combat that with a um, splash of cool water from the sink. I know it goes against what the micellar water is supposed to do, 
But if you have oily, oily skin like I do, and sometimes when you want an extra boost of clean, just splash some cool water on your face and then go ahead and blot dry your face with a towel or something and that should do it. That usually does it for me. Otherwise, I don't have much more to say about this. This is a really phenomenal product, five out of five stars, and I can definitely see myself purchasing another bottle. In fact, I will do just that once I'm done with the little bit that I have left. In fact, I'm gonna be using it today, right after this reveal. But I don't have any, much, any more to say about this. Um, one more thing, I have not tried the Garnier Micellar Water, so I cannot compare this product with that product. So unfortunately, if you have any questions about how this product fares up against the Garnier Micellar Water, I can't answer those since I've never used the Garnier brand of Micellar Water before. But I love this product, definitely I'm going to purchase it again. If you've tried it, let me know in the comments below and feel free to tell me your skin type and how this works very well for your skin type too. If you have any tips, comments below. If you know, like I said at the very beginning, if you know any other place where this particular product is located, comments below. And if you like my video, a thumbs up is always appreciated. I do appreciate you guys sticking with me since I'm like over 400 subscribers now. But thank you guys, welcome aboard to all the new subscribers here, and I will try to get out as many videos as possible. I should be getting out some more since I'm nearly done with the semester and it's around Christmas break. Yes, my favorite holiday is coming up. But I will see you guys in the next video. So for now, I need to go ahead and get undressed and get some rest because it's been a long day. So I will see you guys later. See ya.